Hey again, it's about time for another walk through the Dollar Tree because they have tons of new summer items. They have like gardening items and flip-flops and all of like their tropical things out. So um, I think it's there's lots of new stuff. I'm pretty excited. So keep on watching. I don't have a bad dad joke today and I don't feel like looking one up. So sorry. Joke's on me. For you. Okay, I finally found their new garden items and they're so cute. These round signs are cute as they are or they would be good to paint over and make other things out of. And they have these two signs, Weed It and Reap and Fresh Flower Market. They also had some of these hanging signs and there are three different ones and I personally would probably take these apart and make something else out of them, but they're cute like they are. Here's this one, it says, um, we were meant to be. And then this one's staying alive with some garden tools. I don't think I've seen them do anything like this before. And they always have their tropical themed summer stuff. Here are some cups. And here's just a peek at some of what they have. I didn't show anything up close, but I will in a little bit. Anytime they do these sticker books, I think they say Let's Planner at the top. You get like over 300 stickers and they usually have some pretty cute ones, so keep an eye out for these. I like to use them in my planner at school. I'm doing my best here to just show you what's inside with one hand. And these are new to me. I've seen the potted lavender before, but not this potted greenery. And I saw three different types of leaves. They had some new summer tumblers. They're kind of holographic and I don't know why I'm going so fast and not showing you guys the designs on these very well, but they were really cute. And I think they had these last year, the little bottles with the straws and the fruit on them. They're super cute, but they do not go through the dishwasher very well. And I know it says hand wash, but if it's, if it's hand wash, it's a no for me. <laughs> Okay, so here are their little sections. They have the dark blue with the shells theme going on, and then the red with the fruit, the teal and the pineapple, and these plates caught my eye. Look how pretty. and the pink flamingos. They had some of these skinny cups and then these ice cream bowls. Is that what they're calling them? Ice cream cups and some cute ice cream napkins. Be perfect for a little ice cream sundae party. And these, you only get four for a dollar, but they're kind of pretty, I guess. These are huge. I would fill it up with tons of ice and lemonade and lay by the pool that I don't have. <coughs> and they are kind of following that same theme that we saw earlier with the pink and the flamingos, the red and the fruit. Here are some summer signs. 
I usually don't love these signs. Like I wouldn't hang these in my house, but look at the little tropical car. That's pretty cute. And these ones, these rectangle ones are good for painting on the back. They have their little sequin, sequin, not sequin. What's that stuff called? And I can never remember. Flamingos and pineapple. And here are some little craft items. Those are headbands, and then you got the grass skirts. And these plates are so cute. There's the watermelon one, and a lemon, and an orange slice. And I feel like there should be a lime too. But I only saw napkins that were lime, and they these are round, so they're really cute, 16. Okay, coasters, these are weird. I probably wouldn't use them as coasters, and I don't really get like the bow, but I don't know. I picture like making garland or something out of it. And look how fun these stirrers are. They have the flamingos in the two different colors. I think these would be cute stuck in like a tropical looking flower arrangement. Got the cactus and pineapple. Here they've got some colored shot glasses. Makes me want to have a tropical party with all the friends I don't have. They had tons of different banners that were tropical themed. This one says, hello summer. And I don't think I've seen them do the confetti like this before. You get like three different packs. That one has pineapples. This one has like the little tiki heads. And some flowers. Giant serving trays in the fun fluorescent colors. And the cutest napkins. If you could see my collection of Dollar Tree napkins that I never use. <laughs> I really did want these pineapple ones though. Tough but sweet. And some fun plates, more summer please. You get 12 in a pack. The pineapple again. And I remember this print from last year. And these little pineapple serving trays are back. I only saw it in the pink and white, but I remember last year they had, I think, blue, green, and yellow as well. Here are some goblets, is that what you call these? This one has palm trees on it, has a pineapple, and then like the tiki head, is that what you call those? And some more party glasses, plastic glasses. That fishing net is good for like beach decor if you have, if you're into any of that. There's a little pineapple cup. And I can't tell if this is a chunky flamingo or a, a toucan. Some fun novelty glasses, more decorations. These two pack cups are cute, tropical vibes. And I know everyone's been looking for these, the house shaped frames. They hold a four by six picture. You can hang them up or they have the kickstand on the back. And then one of these random boxes, that was the only one there. So yes, I tossed it in my basket. 
and they had these sticky notes, like these little packages that come in different like sizes and styles. And I usually don't love Dollar Tree sticky notes. Like I feel like when I, I peel them and then stick them, they just kind of curl. I don't know, maybe I'm too picky, but I wish that I liked these because I would buy them. And I think they had a couple more styles too, but I'm only showing you, I think just those two. And this was random, dream big. I think this is like a Mother's Day gift area. Yeah, okay, and then they did mom balloons. Look how cute, you got the baby pink and then the hot pink. And I think that was all as far as the colors go. And they got more of these. I forget what they're called, but you can do a lot of fun things with those. They had a ton at my store. And some diffusers. I've never tried these, but I did pick up one to try. So I'll let you know over on my Instagram what I think of it. And I'll put that in the description box. And here is a giant flying bubble disc. Bubbles not included, but you can get a huge thing of bubbles at the Dollar Tree. It came in a few different colors. And then some random fashion gems. And this Juncture brand, I've been seeing a lot. I think it must be a new Dollar Tree brand. They have these that can be like headbands, scarves, or masks. I'm not buying any more masks. The mandate got lifted in our state. And so now you can go places without a mask. It's kind of weird. Okay, here's the tray that everyone's been raving about. So you can see it's just in the section with like the other clear party trays that they always have all the time. I tried to show you these bowls, but couldn't really get any out. So here are some little votive holders for Mother's Day. And some, what do we call these? Wine glasses, wine tumblers. Best mom in the history of ever. I can buy that for myself. Hashtag super mom. And if you would like a pom-pom hanging from your phone, then you should buy this phone ring with strap. Comes in white as well. <laughs> they randomly will get these bath bombs in. I saw a new one and it was called Mermaid Life. You can see the scent on there. They're pretty good as far as bath bombs go. And then I bought this foot mask because I usually get one from Walmart. That's about five bucks. That works really well. So I'll test that one out for you guys and, and let you know. Here's the giant candy jars everyone's looking for. Here is some Global Beauty Care gel face masks. There's the rose one and then a hyaluronic acid. They have some serums. And then some fragrance mist, some little perfume sprays. I like the packaging. Curious about how it smells though. And I love putting these on my eyes. I feel like a queen when I do it. Put them in the freezer or fridge. Put them on your eyes. It's supposed to reduce puffiness. And here are some new journals. These are by Jot. And like I always say, I don't like the ones that have the spine like this because I feel like they're hard to open and write in. I like the ones with the spiral. But look at this Be Awesome one.
And then they have these again that have the sticker sheets in the front. And these notebooks, they look really cool. It kind of hurts my brain, but they have that pretty rose gold, purple. Silver, the bright blue, and black. And some random Mike and Ikes, root beer float flavor or cotton candy. I don't like Mike and Ikes, but if you do, you probably want to try those. They have some new containers for like their, they say happy birthday and stuff on them. So I think they'd be cute to put little birthday gifts in or even just a gift card, like with some of their shredded paper stuff. I'm forgetting what it's called right now. Flower shaped boxes. So many little boxes. I thought these ones were pretty. They're not necessarily for birthdays. You could use those for a lot of things. And some polka dot boxes. And here is some tissue paper. And you only get like eight sheets in some of these, but the prints are really pretty. Um, but I'll stick to like the huge packs that you get. And look at these gnome stakes for July. I'm going to rip the steak part off and you can use these like in wreaths or other decor. And here's one that's just a head. I don't like this one as much. I like the, the whole body one. And some star flags, flags, stars, star flags, no. Some patriotic star stakes. Here are some new pots. I like the colors, I like the design on there. And then here is some of their floral. Dollar Tree floral is hit and miss. I feel like they always do a really good job with spring and then fall, summer. A lot of them look kind of cheesy to me, um, but there are some pretty ones in here. Here are some more serving platters shaped like a surfboard. Is that what that's supposed to be? Some bowls. And some more plates. And what are these supposed to be? Like placemats, decorations for the wall? I don't know. Some lemon and pineapple stickers. I don't think I've seen this table, table scatter before. These are cute. I would take them apart and use the little pieces for other projects. And then here are some little porcelain angels. You've got one playing the violin, smelling a flower. And one is reading a book. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and smash that like. That's what my son says. Smash that like, smash that like. Okay, bye.